Hey you guys, it's Brie aka Smartista Beauty and raise your hand if you're like me and you're a night owl. You go to bed at 2 in the morning and then you're like, I'm gonna get up at 8 and conquer the world the next day. But then you wake up and you realize you've overslept again. So you have about 15 minutes to conquer the world, go into beast mode, and be on time for class. So step one is assess the damage. After I've completely fallen out of bed, I try to see if I'm like, you know, what the hair is looking like, my skin, everything. Then step two, I lose everything. For some reason when I'm in panic mode, I can't find anything I'm looking for. Things that were full yesterday are empty today. A big part of the Fearlessly Beautiful movement is thinking positively, so anytime I'm running a little bit late, I try not to beat myself up about it and just think of ways I can correct it in the future. I like to think the universe has its own special reason for keeping little old me late this specific day. So yeah, I just try to stay positive about it. Quick tip for making oversleeping a little more fluid and a lot less stressful is just remaining organized the night before and just in the weeks coming. So one way I like to stay organized is by using a bunch of different apps. There are a lot of really great apps, but one I've personally been using lately that I think is really cool is this app called Snups, which is a virtual shelving app. And it's really cool because I like sneakers, I like clothes, fashion, makeup, and I can explore other people's collections and see where they bought things. And this is my personal page, so I show you guys here where I get some of the really cute outfits and items and accessories and some of my favorite things that you see in a lot of my photos. This app helps you keep track of what you already have, it prevents you from buying duplicates of the same thing, and even organize empty products so you know what color and shade to get. So I'm going to show you here how to actually post something to Snups, and basically I just take a picture, and this is something I'm going to use in today's tutorial, and then I just type in the brand information, and I decide what shelf to add it to. So I made a custom shelf for this tutorial, which is makeup and I added a lot of items that you're gonna see towards the end of this video. If you guys would like to see more about my makeup shelf or just my profile in general, I've included a link in the description box and that way you can also explore other people's collections and the app in general. If you're interested, that link will be in the description box below. I also really like that I can rate the items I put on my shelf, especially with hair and makeup. This helps me remember what I really loved and what I could go without buying again. Now for those of us who have overslept, this beast mode clock starts right now. It is crazy crunch time guys. So I like to make a cup of tea really quick as you know I'm addicted to tea. So this is just some organic green tea and I'm using my 30 second hot pot that boils water super fast and some organic honey which is my favorite combo and this really cute Christmas cup I got on sale because it's definitely Halloween time. I was gonna make a joke about the early bird getting the worm with this cup but we're definitely running late. So next step is so fresh and so clean clean to my outcast fans. I try to just spread makeup over the counter and take a five minute super quick shower. I use my body soap, I wash my face in the shower to save time, and I throw a little conditioner in my hair. Then I run. Step five, where do you at do? I find an outfit. Now step six, appear normal. I tackle my curly hair in four minutes and my makeup in five. I do my classic sleek low bun. Then I put a scarf on while I do my makeup to make my bun lay super flat. Then I'm just going in and doing 5 minute makeup, adding my NYX Illuminating Primer, and I'm just spreading that on quickly. Then I'm using my Ruby Kisses BB Cream. It gives like the moisture of a moisturizer with the coverage of a foundation. And I just spread that with my hands. Flawless application quickly. I use my Real Techniques Complexion Sponge. And then I take my Kat Von D Tattoo Locket Concealer in Deep 34, and then I just buff that in as well with the same sponge. And yeah, it's super quick and this is only about 45 seconds worth of makeup time. I've become a pro at doing makeup on the fly these days. Um, yeah, so I just blend that super well into my skin using the sponge, which saves me so much time. Then I'm going to take my good old handy dandy Maybelline Fit Me powder that's like two shades darker than my skin and I use that to just warm up my face a little bit. To make this makeup look super dewy and natural I quickly spray everything afterwards with my NYX setting spray in dewy and then I move right on to eyeliner. The perfect wing is a science and to help me I use this duo wing pen and this gives me a super perfect wing in less than 30 seconds. Ain't nobody got time for a super defined lip when you're running late, so I usually just do chapstick or lip gloss. After chugging my tea, I usually like to be comfy and warm for class, so I'll throw on something sporty like a hoodie, and then 
take off my scarf to see my bun. Ooh la la, quick and easy. Now, homies, we are down to the wire. I throw on my backpack and my Sony Bluetooth headphones. The last thing I want to do while I'm running late is get tangled or try to untangle a headphone cord. I do work out and I want to be alert in class. I do have quick, easy snacks like bananas and cliff bars laying around that I can just grab. And I know when that hotline blings, it means it's time to go to class. Bye, guys, and I'll try to wake up earlier tomorrow. Why are you always lying? My heart is away. Uh, Think about you all the time. 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 Think about you all the time.